Hey, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tiffany. And if this is your first time clicking on my videos or seeing my face, welcome. Today's video is going to be an eyebrow tutorial, a how to, so to speak. As you guys can see, my hair is red. Like it's red, red. It's not off red. It's not all burn. It's not whatever a dusty red it's not a fake red it's red okay so I decided because my hair is so bright I wanted to do my eyebrows to match my hair kind of I will insert a picture of what I am talking about so I am obsessed with how that looks and I'm sure it's probably a thousand colored brow tutorials on YouTube but who cares this is me this is how I'm doing it so I wanted to show you guys how I was doing it and I figured somebody wanted to see. Somebody didn't see those other videos, or they did, and they still wanted to see mine because they support me and they love me. So that's what we're going to be doing today. If you guys are interested in seeing me do a brow tutorial with my burgundy brows, then make sure you stay tuned to the video and give the video a thumbs up before we jump into it. And without further ado, let go. You guys are up close. Now, as you guys can see, I got my lashes done. I got a little red peeking in there. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that? And I got the other side of my nose pierced. What? Who am I? Okay. So for starters, I have a little bit of serum on my face. We are going to be doing some soap brows. So I'm going to take this soap. I'm going to spray it with a little bit of setting spray. I'm going to take a spoolie. This is from... Paul Nat Powder. This came in a little brow set. I need to move my mirror up because I need to see what's good, what's going on in the hood. And I'm going to just to get some soap up in there. And I feel like you guys can see like from right where you guys are. So I'm just going to brush through my brows. And as you guys can see, my brows are pretty Then, like they're pretty sparse I would say this looks so different already they already look thicker so I want to try to do brow lamination so if you've tried brow lamination please let me know how that worked for you and if you did it and loved it what kit you used to do it because a lot of kits out there and I don't want to be bamboozled swindled let us dry okay so I'm just going to press that in Look at that. That looks so good already. Like, this is already a moment. Can you guys see? Is it like a glare? Looks good. Okay, so. Don't judge me. We've been a little... Look at the difference. It's freaking crazy. We're going to be using the Dose of Colors Blushing Berries Palette. I believe this is the original packaging for the palette, but whatever. We're going to be using this middle shade and a teensy tiny bit of this shade to actually fill in my brows, so to speak. So, where's my brush? I'm going to take this Morphe M156 brush. It's the dual-sided spoolie and then an angled brush on one side. I'm gonna tap into it. I'm gonna line my brow first. Actually, I'm gonna zoom you guys in some. I feel like that didn't even zoom you guys in that much, but I'm going to try to keep this mirror out of the way. I'm just outlining the bottom of my brow. Do y'all see that? I'm gagging. Looks so good. And now I'm going to go on the top. And right where the hair stops, I'm going to start lining. So I'm just following the actual natural shape of my brow once I like soaked them through. Yeah, see that? Oh. 
in the front, I'm going to use the brush still and do little hair like strokes. And then in the back, since I have way less hair towards the back of my brow, I'm going to take a, another brush. This is the Sigma E56. You don't have to take this brush, but this is just like a packer brush. And I'm going to dip into both of those colors I showed you guys and just tap it on my brow. Just hold it. I'm kind of gagging. This looks so good already. Okay, so now I'm going to take my concealer and I'm going to be taking the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Fawn. I haven't used this in a long time, mainly because I lost it. I just found it. It was in one of my drawers. She's back now. And I'm going to line the bottom of my brow. Don't want to line the bottom or the top first. I'll line the bottom first. And I'm going to actually take this brush on the concealer. You guys get the gist of it? I need to put the mirror in front of my face. So I'm asking before I do that so you guys aren't too mad. But I have to put the mirror just so I can see up close. the gag is this looks so good okay and then I'm going to take a foundation well a foundation shade my foundation shade and I'm going to take the hourglass vanish stick and sable to actually line the top and I'm going to take that same brush I'm going to wipe it off first because I don't want that light shade on top of my brow I'm going to take this same little ruby kisses brush give it a little do 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 Put some on top of my brow. And this is just to clean it up a little bit. And that is the brow. I'm gonna go off camera and do the other one, and then I'll be right back. I just wanted to give y'all one last close up of the brows. Both of them are done now. I'm gagging. They look so good. I don't have any other makeup on. It looks good from afar too. But that is that for this video. If you like this tutorial, give this video a thumbs up. Let me know down in the comments what else you guys want to see from me. If you love my bantu knots, let me know that too. If you want a tutorial on my little bantu knots, let me know that too. Because I have super short hair. And if you want to know how I got these, I would love to show you. But that is all I got for today. So like I always tell you guys, I'm your girl Tiffany. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.